Hello Candy Lovers! Now today I'm going to share to you how to do your own airbrush makeup and the airbrush system that I'm going to use is this from Beauty HD and I think some of you may already know this brand here in the Philippines and this one is the most affordable airbrush kit that's out there. I think for this kit you're gonna I think this kit is only 3,999. So brang cheap, so brang cheap niya and, and very handy. So brang handy niya. And I like the color. It's color white, very classy and clean. So um, this kit has a compressor. That this is the compressor. Now you also have this airbrush gun holder, which you're gonna attach right here. And then an airbrush gun. And then air. Um, this is the air hose na naka-attach din dito sa compressor and then we have the adapter 220 volt adapter na i-attach ko siya dyan. Now, and then we have this on and off button. Pag may green siya, ibig sabihin on na siya. So, para siyang volume, di ba? So, may kita nyo na parang this one is the most um, konting hangin and then yung ito, yung sobrang lakas na hangin na siya. Sorry for my Tagalog. <laughs> Yun. And then, so as you can see, I place my airbrush gun this side, facing downwards, because for me, it's easier to grab your airbrush gun this way, rather than this way, diba? Parang it's hard for me to grab it. And at the same time, if you already put the um, airbrush liquid here, baka may tendency na tumapon siya. So, this side is better and safe to use. So that's that. And then, I also have three second skin airbrush makeup. And then we have the color porcelain, which is kind of lighter on my skin. Diba? And then we have Tofi. Medyo darker naman siya. And then we have pink, which is a very beautiful blush. Meron siyang parang gold shimmer inside. So that will give you a very nice glow. So, so it says here um, that this... Beauty HD Second Skin Airbrush Makeup is hypoallergenic, water-based, non-comedogenic, full and flawless coverage, sets quickly. Do not add any liquid, shake well before using it. Of course, you really have to shake well para maganda yung color na lalabas. Tsaka para yung bubo o mawala. Shake, shake, shake! So, in order for me to get the right shade of foundation for my skin, I'm gonna combine porcelain and tofi together. So, and then for my blush, this is going to be the pink. And so, I'm going to use this porcelain alone for highlighting and tofi for contouring. So, the first thing that you're gonna do is to tie your hair, place a pin or use a headband. Basta, just make sure that your hair is not going to be on your face para if you're gonna use the airbrush makeup hindi siya nagkakalat-kalat yun sa mukha mo so that's and then I'm just gonna wash my face and be back so I'm now back with a bare face as you can see I have a lot of imperfections on my face I have my dark circles blemishes right there and yeah so um, I already mixed my foundation so I think six drops of porcelain and three drops of tofi and then for you to be able to mix the two foundations well you have to place your hand on the front and then just move your nozzle I don't know if you can see it oops para mag ano siya then siya just to make sure na na achieve niyo yung right color uh, go high on tissue and then just spray it so I'm gonna so I'm gonna set the air pressure in middle. Oops. Yan. Middle lang. Six inches away from your face, and then you have to press the nozzle, and then um, in a circular motion, yan. Gagaling ganin yun nakshas sa face mo para even yung coverage. So I'm now gonna start. Malamig siya sa face and very lightweight. Siyempre, don't forget your neck as well. 
medyo nilapit ko yung airbrush gun sa may chin area ko because gusto ko mas ma-cover ma yung mga blemishes ko and dark circles. Ayan. So now this is the first layer of my airbrush makeup. So I think I'm now going to proceed in highlighting and contouring. So I'm gonna place this um, porcelain in my airbrush gun. So five drops down. And then on my forehead, nose, chin, my cheek lane. So I already highlighted my face. Now I'm going to contour and I'm just grabbing this two feet for mga five drops then. Now I'm going to contour my face. I'm going to start on my hollows of the cheeks. Then temple, hairline. Hollows of the cheeks. Then jawline. Then the sides of my nose. A little bit. And then some crease area yeah. and then slowly building the color by adding it so tapos na rin ako mag contour so this is the look so kinontour ko yung hollows of the cheeks, temples and jawline hairline, nose line chin and then on the other side as well Hanggang sa makita nyo naman yun yung snake binubuga niyang hair, ibig sabihin, pwede ka nang maglagay another color. As you can see, our airbrush gun is already clean. Now, I'm going to get my color pink for my blush and mixing it really well. Or shaking it really well. I think five drops then. to apply blush on the apples of my cheeks and then blending it on my temple. Smile! Okay, kung ano yung natira, i-blend ko lang siya sa may hairline ko sa temple. So I'm done doing my airbrush foundation, highlighting and contouring, and also putting blush on your face. So this is how it looks like on me. And after that, I'm just going to get my um, Glory of New York translucent powder to seal my airbrush makeup. Just a little bit. set siya. Very well. I'm just going to get my eyebrow comb and comb my eyebrows because nilagyan siya ng airbrush foundation. It feels very lightweight on your skin. Hindi nyo mapapansin na may suot kayong makeup. And then, um, kung hindi kayo sanay, kasi sa una, parang ang dami niya sa face. Um, I suggest that you have to practice first on tissue or paper so that you're gonna have an idea on how to control the nozzle. Because this nozzle is the one who release, that releases the air pressure. So, um, at first, 
medyo parang blotchy or nagsisplatter. So, you really have to um, uh, learn this nozzle, controlling the nozzle, and of course, yung um, air pressure din. So, pag mas mahina yung pressure, mas konti lang yung nirelease niyang air, meaning, konti lang din yung air brush liquid na ilalabas niya. So, so, pag mas malakas naman, mas malakas yung pressure ng air, meaning, mas madami yung airbrush makeup na ibubuga niya sa face nyo. So, kailangan nyo rin pag-aralan yung tamang pressure ng air and the nozzle check. And then after that, you're good to go. So, so if you really want to cover more, let's say, your dark circles, your blemishes, dark spots, um, I suggest na ibabaan niyo yung pressure ng air and then medyo ilapit niyo yung airbrush gun dun sa problem areas nyo. Pero make sure na hindi kayo nakastegy lang ng ganyan kasi kung hindi, mamumuho siya. So, kailangan, kahit na nakastegy, kahit na, na malapit siya sa face nyo, kailangan gumagalaw-galaw pa rin siya para even yung coverage. So, so, that's my review and demo for the Beauty HD Airbrush System. I hope you guys enjoy watching my video and find this very helpful and easy to do. And yeah, if you have any more questions, just comment down below and I'll try to answer all of them. And if you want to get your own Beauty HD Airbrush system, I'll put her links down below so that you're going to check out where to buy them, how to use them more, or if you have promos, you can check them in my information box. So this kit is for only 3999 but if you want to get the three um, Beauty HD Second Skin, airbrush makeup it's 4999 so um yeah uh, thank you so much candy lovers for watching my video and i hope to see you soon take care god bless bye